Hello friends, welcome back to our YouTube channel. Did you know that the first plastic surgery in the world was performed by an Indian surgeon whose name was Maharishi Susrut. Nearly 2600 years ago, this Indian physician of ancient India, also called the father of surgery, invented nearly 300 surgeries and also taught them. From where did Susrut find his inspiration for surgery and how did he manage these inventions? We will find answers to such questions in today's video. Nearly 2600 years ago during the Vedic era, Susrut lived in, in the ancient city of Kasi in the northern part of India, which today is better known as Banaras or Varanasi. During these days, intellectual people were called monk or Maharishi. One such intellectual person was Susrut. Susrut acquired his knowledge of medicine from Kasi Raj Divodas, the king of Kasi, and he became a physician. As a physician, he treated soldiers who got injured on the battlefield. Looking at the condition of those soldiers, Susrut found his inspiration for surgery. He would fix the broken parts or injury through surgery. In those days, the punishment for any illegal crime was to chop up the criminal nose. Susrut invented the rhinoplasty or the nose surgery through which he could reconstruct the broken nose. Susrut was also the first cataract surgeon who treated many eye problems, who did his work with love and affection, invented a scientific skill like surgery which was a new concept in those times. Due to these reasons, he is also considered as father of all surgery. Along with inventing surgery, he realized that he will need several surgical instruments. And necessity is the mother of all inventions. Keeping this necessity in mind, Susrut invented 121 surgical instruments. And he was the first surgeon in the world to do this. And this invention proved that Maharishi Susrut knowledge has stood the test of time. Susrut recorded his knowledge in details in the form of a Sanskrit script which is also called the Susrut Samhita. The Sanskrit script which explains the procedures of surgery is one of the three pillars of Ayurveda as well as a uh, chapter in the Atharved. Susrut Samhita explains that how Susrut performed the dissection of a dead body and examined them without a knife. His method of learning human anatomy was like this. He would keep the dead body in water and let it decompose. This is how he examined the structure of the body layer by layer. This method helps Susrut invent complex surgeries like caesarean, abdominal surgery and brain surgery. Chapter 1.16 of Susrut Samhita explains nose reconstruction surgery or rhinoplasty in detail. Susrut is also known as cataract surgery. It is written in great detail in one of Susrut Samhita volumes called Uttar Tantra. This process looks like the extraction of extracapsular lens, extraction to modern surgeons, but Susrut performed this surgery without modern equipments, which defined his skills. Susrut Samhita was written in 600 BCE, this unique Sanskrit script about surgery and medicine. The Susrut Samhita documented the etiology of more than 1100 diseases, the use of 100 of medicinal plants, and instruction for performing course of surgical procedures, including three types of skin grafts and reconstruction of the nose. He was one of the first people in human history to suggest that a student of surgery should learn about the human body and its organ by dissecting a dead body. The most important point to note here is that the dissection was performed without a knife. Maharishi Susrut made his name proud. He became famous all over the world because of his work but he also developed the Indian medical knowledge much more as compared to others. So friends, if you like this video, please like, share and subscribe my YouTube channel and don't forget to press the bell icon. Thank you.